I'm going to teach you an act of magic. I'm going to show you how to do something magical with your own mind. You're not going to believe. I'm going to tell you what you're going to do. You see that object up there? You're going to make it disappear right in front of your eyes. You're not going to see it. And you're not going to close your eyes. I'm not going to change the slide. Well, at first, I'm going to show you how to do this. So you allow me to change the slide while I do that. But once I get it up there, you're going to do it yourself. You're going to make that object completely vanish right before your eyes just by changing your thought processes. Do you believe that? You guys are gullible, aren't you? <laughs> how many think that's total nonsense? It's impossible. If that's, tell me if it's total nonsense. It can't be done. I know what I see. First umpire, right? Okay, I'm telling you, there ain't nothing until you call them. So we're going to learn how to call and make something out of nothing or nothing from something or whatever we're going to do. So I want you to look at this object for a while, and I want you to tell me right now, in your mind at least, what you see up there. What would you call that object? A cube? A box? Can we, can we, can we agree to call it a cube for a while? A cube, okay? All right, good. Now that we see the cube, I'm now going to ask you to look at it, and I'm going to point out to you with my little arrow, you see this strut along this, this bar right here? And you see this one over here? And this, this one over here? And then this one over here. You see those four struts? They outline a square, do they not? Okay. Call that one upper square. Okay. Now here's another square. You see this one here? Goes down like this, and down like up around this, and up. You see that one? That's also a square. Isn't that not also a square? Call that the lower square. Okay. Now the first part of this experiment, this experience, is I want you to tell me which square is in front, the upper or the lower. Now, before you answer, I want to show you how you're going to answer. You can, there's only two ways you can answer. If you see the upper in front, you're going to raise your right hand. If you see the lower in front, you're going to raise your left hand. Okay? Now, if it's constantly changing, you're going to wigwag at me. All right, good. Now, for, okay, now, first of all, I would like to see hands of people that do not see it changing. Please raise your hands if you don't see it changing. You've got to participate. You can't just sit there like this. You can't, sit, you can't do that. You've got to leave. You've got to sit like that. If, you, if you're going to put your finger there, put it in your nose, and then it's okay. That, that all allow. That all, if you stand away from your nose, I'll say that's okay. Okay, but you can't just sit there and think. Who does not see it jump at all? If you don't, raise your hand. Okay, if you don't see it jump, I'm not, okay, good. Some of you don't. Uh, let me tell you something about yourselves. Ooh. What are you going to tell us? First, I want to say, I'm going to tell you a, a compliment. You're very intelligent beings. Now I'm going to give you an insult. You can't draw worth a damn. <laughs> Art is not your forte. Thinking, yes, logical, rational thinking, you're very good at that, but when it comes to drawing, that's something that's not quite your forte. Um, so this is going to help you open that other side of you up a little bit, that drawing side of you, which if you don't see it. By the way, if you keep looking at it for a while, eventually it'll jump, even for you. How many have not seen it jump for the first time? Just saw it happen? Okay. Was it good for you as it was for me? Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, let me tell you what the, what, what's going on here. Uh, just give you a few, few words of description. Of course, this is a, an optical illusion. I mean, it's a flat screen, and it's a, it's a picture. I mean, it's an optical illusion. It's a trick. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I'm not, gonna try, I'm not trying to claim super mastery here. It's a trick, but that's no, okay. It's okay. Just bear with me. It's an, a visual metaphor. It's an analog. It's an analogy of what is meant by the way